In this video, I'll be reviewing the Exobog Nano, that is uh, this cat toy with my small kitten, Jimmy. I'll show you how it works and also give you my opinion at the end. So let's get started. But before starting, let's make a quick tour of this uh, quite a strange toy, I would say. It's very simple. It has only one function, actually, is when you turn it around, it has an on and off switch. You turn it on and it starts vibrating. And by vibrating, this small bug, let's call it this way, will be able to move itself quite randomly and it's supposed to, you know, make your cat interested in chasing it. There's a few ways that you can use this toy. The first one is to just put it down, turn it on and uh, let the cat have fun with it. And as you can see here, Jimmy is having quite a bit of fun with it. Although it's not super fast. On certain occasion it will turn on the side and it will get stuck a bit like this. On the box they say that uh, this exobug is supposed to come back to life by itself. And uh, here we go. Unfortunately after I would say maybe 5 minutes little Jimmy got bored or maybe distracted by other stuff in the house. So then I decided to put it in an enclosed space. I got this yoga wheel. And what it does is that every time it bumps into, so you see, the yoga wheel, it's trying to change direction. It's quite random and I think this is what attracts the cat. After using it a few times, I think this is the way to go, really. If you don't have that kind of yoga wheel, I'm sure you can find other things. Maybe, you know, a box or something that has small walls on the sides so it doesn't escape. Jimmy had a lot of fun. I tried using it on different material. This is a yoga mat. Unfortunately, this is no good and I will show you why. It's barely moving. And this can be said for other surfaces, like if you have carpets, forget about it. This won't go anywhere. My cat still has fun because, you know, it's vibrating, but uh, yeah, it's not the same kind of tone you would expect it to move a, a bit more. Actually, forget what I said. I think it works, but you need to switch it on its back for it to move. And this is the max it can do. To conclude this video, I'll give this toy a 4 out of 5. I think for the price, it does a pretty good job entertaining my kitten for, you know, a few minutes at least. The trick is uh, I need to hide it every time I'm not playing with it. So this this way he doesn't get used of seeing it and the novelty factor uh, doesn't wear off after just a few days. So thanks for watching. Please subscribe, leave a like and why not even comment.